Yeah, how'd Probably you guys meet? Yeah. Uh, Instagram. Really? <laughs> she, so we both have mutual friends. I followed her like a while before we actually talked. She didn't follow me back. <laughs> she had a boyfriend. I didn't know about that. Jeez. Oh. She, she didn't, didn't, get po- she didn't post him? So she, I didn't get the follow back. Uh, that's cool. Oh, that's loyalty, though. Yeah, 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 that's, yeah what that's what you yeah, want. That's what you want. That's what you want for sure. Yeah. And then a while later, she eventually followed me back. Might have bit a few pictures, and yeah. I was like, "Don't you have a boyfriend?" Because I knew she had a boyfriend. Yeah. And then I guess she didn't have a boyfriend. Yeah. So then I went home, hung out. The rest is history. The rest is history. Yeah. I have to ask, what was the initial line? He liked her. I, she actually DM me first. Ooh. Yeah. Because I thought she had a boyfriend the whole time. Okay. So I was like, she followed me back. I was kind of confused. And uh, so there's a fake Snapchat. Mm-hmm. Um, you know what I'm talking about? There was like a catfish. I saw something about that. Yeah, but so yeah, someone's impersonating me um, on Snapchat. Are they, you serious? Yeah, so if you see the Snapchat Keaton Slovis, that is not me. Okay. My username is not <laughs> Keaton Slovis on Snapchat. Oh, shit. And I guess they were like catfishing girls. Whoa. I guess, so I, I got a bunch of people like, hey. Damn, you're like that? I didn't even realize that. <laughs> <laughs> like, be careful who I'm talking to. They, uh, so they were like, bunch of people reached out to me like hey like did you dm me and uh, or like like on, on snapchat, snapchat. Yeah. yeah and i was like no it wasn't me so there's was a few times on instagram i posted it was like hey this isn't me yeah i'm not this creep because i guess they're doing weird stuff yeah you need to talk about but uh goodness so i was kind of like i kind of posted it one time i was like hey this isn't me and she was like oh they added me like i wish it was you though and i was like Ooh. oh kind of smooth yeah that's so smooth yeah, yeah there we go was she joking or did they actually messaged her on the fake i account? think they actually did because i asked yeah. her like later like did they actually mess did yeah. they actually add you because i guess they were going through my like followed list yeah so that's the thing that's crazy about the, the catfish they were yeah. smart about ah. it so if someone followed me they'd add yeah. them on snapchat so they thought it was like <laughs> yeah me because totally yeah. Time sense. Up, right? yeah yeah we can really unpack this so you're really following a lot of bad females then <laughs> <laughs> that's really that's really what's going on they i, I think it was their the people who followed me got you oh, okay the girls that followed you I okay i don't follow or at least maybe i used to i don't, <laughs> I don't, I don't follow that that many girls anymore i'm a girl like i'm mad at me oh my gosh that's so funny i love that from a girl though she's the one who reached out like yeah ladies need to take notes you know what i'm saying like that's great it can't always be the guy cat i mean i, don't know. I, mean, I feel like i feel like i'm more traditional in the sense that like i think it like it takes a lot for a guy to walk up and say that they're interested but also i have done that and then like they almost feel emasculated like i gotta I, really like i made the i don't even I, know what emasculated means like, like they it, felt like they weren't like a yeah. man. Oh, like yeah. they felt like by me making that move that they it like took away part of their masculine. They're like, like they felt like they didn't have like you know the balls to do it. And then when I did it, you know, that's happened a couple of times. So does it turn out to be a good situation? Oh or? no, it turned out so like done ended. Really? Yeah. yeah. Like ended I, bad. Yeah. Hmm. Huh. Well, like, I could kind of see that though. Yeah. Like I've I feel like. In this situation, worked out, but I feel like in most cases, when yeah. a girl comes up to me, I'm kind of like, "Why are you?" But in her yeah. case, we had mutual friends. Oh, man, she had a boyfriend, so that's why I didn't reach out first. Yeah, right. but I do get what you're saying. It's like it's this line of like confidence versus doing what the guy should have done. Mm. You know, like a girl can have confidence, but it could either be portrayed that way as like, "Oh wow, like she's confident," yeah. or it could be portrayed as, you know, "Damn, she made me look like a tool for not doing it." Therefore, like I don't want to be with somebody who like you know, gives more than I, I don't know. I will say though, if a guy doesn't reach out for a while, I think the girl has all the right to go ahead. Exactly. That's the, that's, guy, that's the situation yeah, that I was in. I was like move. this awkward just, gray area. Yeah, and then, yeah. you know. But like, if it's social media, it's like a, it's a like thing. So like, if you like her pictures and then you don't, are you saying like, and you don't reach out that she should come back and like do something? I don't know. Do they still play phone, oh, with, like with tag? Liking? I'm not going to yeah, lie. Yeah, yeah. It's so like everyone's different, right? But like, some people they'll like old photos, and then if you get the likes back, then that's like the okay. Oh, that's the okay. Like, DM. hey, let me slide yeah, in. Yeah, yeah, yeah. That's funny. Yeah. I, 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 mean, I didn't. You, res- you I didn't. Been out of the game. No, I've been out of the game. Yeah. So, but <laughs> I can. So I, I had your situation a little bit, like in my short time. But like when I first joined the Chiefs, like I had like probably like a hundred. The requests were crazy. Hundred, right? like it while well, I was public, and I would just see like, and one thing that I did notice, like all the guys in the locker room, like they check their Instagram, they check who's following them. All the time. Yeah. Um, but I had like a, you know, 100, 120 people follow me. And probably like 80% of those are girls. And it's like Kansas State, University of Kansas, like University of Missouri. Baddies. It, I don't know if they're baddies or not. <laughs> um, <laughs> and then they would go and like all my, like a bunch of my photos. 
And like it's like mm. I feel like it was strategic sometimes because they would yes. like the photos with like Kimaya. Ooh, that's, yeah, that's bold. That's that's like I was like, whoa. <laughs> I, I mean, we're probably gonna cut and this she one probably, out. She probably, <laughs> well, Kimaya probably sees that because she's tagged in it too. Well, they're probably like, we know you have a girlfriend. We don't care. Yeah, yeah, yeah. yeah. You know, it's funny if you're tagged in a photo and somebody comments on it. Like, let's say, yeah, you get that. Yeah, yeah. yeah you, the person who's tagged yeah, never in commented. It, oh, it's so annoying. But. Yeah. Especially if it's an old photo, you gotta watch out. Yeah, he probably got notified if anybody tried to comment on old photos. Yeah, I hope so. <laughs> <laughs> she said, "I hope so." <laughs> <laughs> I hope so. But yeah, dude, that's that's crazy. Yeah. No, there's a fine line though. But like, it doesn't matter what she says. At some point, like, if you like her, then like, it's cool. Like the confidence, like that whole argument. You know, is it emasculating? Is it not? Like, like same thing with you and your girl. Like, you know, you felt like you had a connection. Like you liked her. Right. Like, it right, didn't matter. Like, yeah, it doesn't matter. Yeah, no, like at that point. 